Hey, it is a very quick analysis on natural gas, gold and crude oil today. So let's start with natural gas first. So what do you have now? As per my yesterday's video, I said that we have a nice bearish candle here, 382 candle and that pushed the market down. Now with that, I've also said that we can expect this move, which we have got now. We do have a 382 candle that is a selling pressure. You might see this move here, a double top move as well. Great. So as you can see, we got this double top move. We have this rejection zone and if you see here previously it's the exact same zone from where the market fallen down as mentioned yesterday as well coming back to it if you enter your trades i would personally keep my stop loss above this rejection zone so that we will have a protection of this sellers here now for me we got a nice bearish engulfing candle that happened in this rejection zone right here so looking at a bearish pressure i'm still expecting market to push down from here, we do have this 20 EMA resist support that push the market up. Once we are completely break, broken and close below 20 EMA, then we have very good chances that market will hit 50 EMA wherever the 50 EMA will be on your charts. Now, do not just take my words on it and do not just place everything on a single trade. This is just my opinion about the market and this is how I personally take my trades and do my analysis. So this is how I see natural gas and still looks bearish to me. We might see another red candle here that would be an extra confluence of sell confirmation we do have an overbought situation and then market came back into the rsi zone so this is what i call rsi divergence coming out of the overbought situation let's check gold right here we have a nice engulfing candle but before that if you remember my yesterday's video the few red candles then a pullback back in this zone which is 1769 goes up to 1785 with that we might see a nice selling reason as an engulfers or a pin bar to take sell trades great so if you follow me from last few months you know that this is a 25 percent candle with that if you would have entered here a few pips below that would be a target that's a 10 dollar move already and now we still have good bearish pressure with this nice engulfing candle and the next zone which i'm seeing is 1741 that goes up to 1746.92 this is a zone from where i expect a bounce this is a minor zone not a major zone if you get a nice engulfers or a double bottom condition then that's a good zone to take your long trade so at this point yes i'm expecting market to keep on pushing down until we hit this zone here we can expect a pullback as well to 50 percent retracement right here which is at 1763 that would be also your entry if you want to enter in an aggressive way target will be 180 r let's check crude oil okay right here as per my yesterday's video we did got a very nice bounce out of this zone minor zone and i've said that i will look for a sell trades once the market hit 50 ema and we did not get any sort of sell condition now i won't be looking at sell trades as we are now breaking above 50 ema once this candle is closed completely broken closed and i would see a next green candle then few red candle if that happened above 50 ema then i will look for a nice engulfing candle to take another long so let's see how this candle close if it closed above and we will look for long trades and then if we have a next candle that closes below back below in this zone and closes below 50 ema that will be an also a bearish signal so that's all for commodity market guys any questions buzz me on instagram i'll get back to you asap i hope you trade green rest of the week i'll see you guys in the next video till then take care